63-year-old Larry Witten uh, is a hotel owner in New Mexico. Taos. And the community of Taos. Mm -hmm. And he is under fire because he has fired several of his Hispanic employees. Um, he has told them that they are not allowed to speak Spanish in his presence. Why, he, why does he think that? Because he's paranoid that they're talking about him. So awesome. Oh, come on. <laughs> That's awesome. And my personal favorite, he wants them to anglicize their names. So Marcos needs to be called Mark, mm -hmm. and Martin needs to be referred to as Martin. Martin. Martin and Mark. Can I call him Martin? <laughs> <laughs> or is that too ethnicized again? I don't know. Okay. Um, first of all, <laughs> clown bag, you live in New Mexico. Yeah. First of all, the name of the state is New Mexico. Okay. Mm -hmm. Second of all, I think they're pretty used to Hispanics in Taos, New yeah, Mexico. I don't think it upsets the hotel guests. I, I love his quote because he insists that he is not racist. Right, just of like course the, not. Just like the uh, Louisiana Justice of the Peace who lets yeah. the black people use his bathroom. <laughs> this is what he has to say. Okay, He had a two-hour interview with the Associated Press. He says, it has nothing to do with racism. I'm not doing it for any reason other than the satisfaction of my guest because people calling from all over America don't know the Spanish accents or the Spanish culture or the Spanish anything. So all of these people are Spanish, <laughs> and they, that's that's it. They're all from Spain. No, but it, like seriously, get out from underneath the rock. I don't know if you know this, okay? And you'll appreciate this probably in your paranoia. Hispanics have taken over the country. Yeah. Okay. They're everywhere. And if you're don't going, tell people, but it's true. If you want to don't tell Lou Dobbs. <laughs> yeah. And if you need, if it's going to bother you that the person who answers the phone at the hotel in Taos uh, has a Spanish accent. Um, I mean, I guarantee you, they don't answer the hotel phone speaking Spanish. <laughs> I understand that. Uh, if they answer it in a Spanish accent, then and that bothers you, uh, well, then uh, don't take your vacation in New Mexico. Go to frickin' Montana. Yeah, and I suggest moving to Iceland or something. Yeah. <laughs> Minnesota, I don't know. But, but yeah. By the way, don't move to Iceland because you can't get a Big Mac. We talked about yeah, that yesterday. Yeah. Right. So, look, uh, it, you know, now let me get a little racist myself. Now, if you got Rajneesh Balakandran, Oh, come okay. on, but everybody hates Indians. I, <laughs> and, you know, look, he can't make his accent go away, but you say, hey, you know, instead of going with Rajneesh and asking every single person who calls in to say, no, Rajneesh, please. Right. Okay. And make him spell it. Go, go with Raj. And you're not anglicizing the name. Raj is an Indian name. They use that as their short version. Yeah, of except, of course, right, except that the way that the, at least those, uh, the phone bags work is they would, the Rajneesh would be, you know, you know, hello, thank you for calling. My name is Kyle. <laughs> yeah, you're like, yeah. why not just Raj? Right? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's just Kyle. Yeah, I'm, uh, like, I'm like, oh, where, where, are, where are you, Kyle? He's like, I am in uh, uh, South Bend, Indiana. One more thing. <laughs> when he was talking to the Associated Press, he also uh, referred to the townsfolk as mountain people and potheads who escaped society. But he's not racist. No, he, just, he hates everyone. <laughs> and, no. you know, as you see his picture, I actually feel a little sorry for him. <laughs> no, but look at him. He looks kind of sad, right? And I know it's just a picture, but it looks like life has passed him by, and he has no idea what the fuck is going on. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? He's like, gee, what happened, man? What are these mountain people up in here, and they're smoking pot, and everybody's Mexican or Spanish? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Who is this guy, Juan? What the hell's a Juan? <laughs> uh, it ain't no magic Juan. And all of a sudden, the whole, it's Taos, New Mexico. Do you know what the fuck happened around you?